What's up guys, Zentra here, welcome to a GTA 5 online video. Now today guys, I'm showing you how to duplicate cards with your friends and just give cards to friends glitch. Also, this can count as a money glitch. Now, this is after patch 1.23 and I think it does work for uh, old gen as well, so it could work for 1.21. I'm not entirely sure, but you can guys leave that in the comment section below if it does work. Now, you would need a friend for this and I've got my friend here. His name's XGN Talk on Xbox, but his YouTube name is Meza. His link will be in the description below because without him, I would not be able to do this glitch. Now, what you want to do is make him park there so when you press Y, you can teleport him. Now, this is vital to the glitch. Now, all you want to do is just drive down here if you've got Eclipse Towers and you just want to go get your vehicle impounded. Now, I suggest using a Karen Rebel or suggest using a Elegy because the Karen Rebel is like everyone just using the glitch at the moment and it just costs nothing. Don't do it with a um, really expensive car because you will have to get your car destroyed. So, I'm going to be talking when I've got my car impounded. Right guys, the police are here, and now all you want to do is just stand on the car and just let them kill you. Also guys, I didn't I didn't think I said it, but this also does work for heist vehicles as well, because the heist update has just come out. And you can actually do it with the, um, the bulletproof car to get a bit more extra money. Now when it says on the top left corner, your personal vehicle has been destroyed. All you want to do is, you could either nick a car, or you could just drive, uh, walk up there. I'm just going to go nick a car, because it saves some time. And all you want to do is just drive to your apartment, and this is where you want your friend to take part. Okay, so guys, when you have got to your apartment, all you want to do is just walk in, and you will need a BMX for this. Now, while you're actually doing this BMX, while, while you're going to your BMX, sorry, you want to have your friend host a messed up session. Now, you really want to communicate with him because you don't want to get this glitch and this part wrong. Now all you want to do is just walk over to your bike until it says you can press right on the D-pad to use this bike. Now I'm going to wait for my mate to host that messed up. Okay, so it's loaded now. Now all you want to do is press start on your Xbox button. You want to go to party. You want to find your net, his friend's name. Now you want to press join game and then you want to press right on the D-pad. You got to keep spamming right on the D-pad. So you join game and keep spamming right on the D-pad. Now this will glitch out a lot. Now all you just want to keep spamming it. And it would come up with, do you want to host this game or do you want to leave this game? Your vehicle getting pounded. Yeah. Now, okay. So here, what you want to do is just wait 20 seconds. So I'm going to be talking back in 20 seconds. Okay, so guys, when your 20 seconds is up, what you want to do is keep spamming A as fast as you can. Now, you would actually hear your garage go. And this is when you know you've done the glitch right. So now you can just unsnap this. You don't need it anymore. And all you want to do is just make have your friends stay in this lobby. Now, um, he has to stay in it. He cannot start it or nothing. So, and then when you do ha when you do join a session, you want to wait till you press quit. So all you want to do is press B, and then you want to press, oh wait, B and A. And when you back out, you should be lagging a lot. It's like, it should be glitching so much. It's worse than the old one, and sometimes this can actually spawn you in some random places. But don't be worried about this, guys. This is when you know the glitch has actually worked. Now, all you want to do is just um, walk over to your garage. And it will be lagging you out really, really badly. So all you want to do is just keep spamming Y until you actually, um, till you, you have to try and aim for the car. And this can take up to five, ten minutes because it does it is very time consuming. But don't worry about this, guys. All you want to do is just keep spamming Y until you actually get in the car. Okay, so when you're in the car, guys, you will spaz out a lot, and you'll you'll be spawned in the vehicle. Now, your friend will be there. All you want to tell him to do is just back out of his meffed up session, and it will say the car is his. Now, if he does say his, tell him to not get in at all. Now, all you want to do is just wait for him to spawn in, and he would spawn in, and he cannot get in because this is his car, but it says it's my car. Well, it says it's his car. But what you want to do is just go into your apartment, just drive in, and you'll be able to drive your friend's car into your garage. Now, what you want to do then is when when you when the car is in the garage, all you want to do is just take it back out again. Now, your friend's car would have spawned by now, so all you want to do is just back, just go out your side outside your garage. And also, you can sell this car, guys. Also, you can sell the elegy as well, I think. Now, as you as you drive out, your friend's car will be there, and my car is here. So now this is my vehicle now, and I could do whatever I want to this. If you did end up enjoying today's video, guys, leave a like, comment, subscribe. As is always appreciated. Go check out Meza. His link will be in the description below, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Goodbye.